Uh, hey guys, sorry. Um, it's, it's me, Dalrunner. Um, 66. I've been on a. Sorry, I've been taking a bit of a break. Uh, forgot to make a video that I was going to take a break, but I'm back now. Um, with another video, I'm just in a Galactic War battle using a weaker team. Um, I got a Sokotano, and I have a really good Jedi team now. You can see I've used Jedi Council and now I've replaced him. My Barris is still the same stars. Ezra has been ranked up. Grandmaster Yoda event, I think, is happening tomorrow, maybe. Unfortunately, I will not be able to get him, but if no one really at my level would be able to get him now, and even if they did, he'd be pretty useless, because I wouldn't be able to get all his abilities. One thing I'd say, advice, never upgrade um, Grandmaster Yoda's leader ability that much. It's not good, unless you're a person who doesn't have good leader, a, a, a good leader, don't use it. All his other abilities, yes, they are good. His basic is good. And that's why actually one thing people are like, oh, use Ezra and Phoenix team. Ezra has some really good synergy with um Yoda. He can because Ezra can use his special ability to call someone to assist based based on their role. And they gain up to forty percent turn meter, I think, if they're a support. And if Yoda the target is about 50% health, I think it is, maybe, yeah, um, or something like that. He gains 40% turn meter and foresight, so you can give him a lot of turn meter, so he can constantly keep having a go. So you want him to assist, Qui-Con would be good with him, in a... Yeah, so, I'm just using a weak team at the moment. But yeah, I've upgraded my characters a lot, I'm hoping to get mods. Um, my advice to mods, crit chance of crit damage for most people. As for Bridger, you want that. Qui-Gon, I'll probably give it to him. Actually, no, Qui-Gon, I'll probably give speed. Because Qui-Gon, his cooldown, especially for his, um, his, abil his assisting ability, has a very short cooldown. But having some crit damage and crit chance is nice. Oh god, so he's getting power of hatred. He must have some really good power of hatred because he's getting turn meter. I kind of hate Darth Maul, like he's a really good character, but the fact that power of hatred it makes him so annoying. I might have to do a Chewy solo on this guy. Yep, it's Chewy solo. And Chewie's gonna lose because he's gonna have Yeah, he's gonna keep having health. He's evading everything. I literally can't attack him. What? I can't I can't hit him. He's got so much evasion. That was him. Oh, yeah, he's got power of hatred too. So he's probably got evasion, yeah. That's really annoying. I, I don't want to have to use too many characters, but I think uh, I've got a really good team planned out, actually. I use this team. Because Talia supports my sister. She grandma gives speed. Tough eye part of surgery, but they're pretty weak, those two. So by having grandma off in the leaders, they're a bit faster. They probably no, they won't outrun him, they'll gain no turn meter. Yeah. So much evasion. I I can't risk using any special abilities. Now, I don't get how he's got so much evasion though, because he, he, he's lost his power of hatred. Sort of an encounter. And unless it wouldn't this wouldn't be encounter unless it doesn't really count. I think it saves it. Oh. Oh, it's got some good scoundrels, they've got Qui Gon. So they've got Count Dooku. Um, yeah, oh yeah, one thing guys, I'm using an app, um, I think you should really get it, it's called Misplay, it's really good, um, it's not a sponsor or anything, but I think it's just like I mentioned if you want what it is, I'm using it because, um, I get units to get, um, gift cards, I'll probably get like a Google one to use, maybe getting some crystals and try and get some good characters, I'm not trying to be like a whale here, they call it, we spend loads of money on it, I'm using it as a sort of free way to get some money, it really helped me, when it comes to, um, it'll probably really help me if I, in the long run, if I do want to get, like, because I probably want to get Darth Sile. Darth Sile is probably one of my f my favourite assist characters, along with Darth Nihilus, of course. Darth Nihilus is good. Um, because Darth Nihilus. I've got a bit of. It just that sometimes, like, I could be using one of Tali's special abilities and it'll just, like, on the way, it just, it'll just stop. It, it just has a bit of... Oh god, I'm probably... Oh, thanks. Right, let's, let's heal. 
Tally's probably going to die. Um, so I hate about Kandooku as well. He keeps counter-attacking. And if you get Kandooku to do some good damage, he can really disrupt, disrupt your team. And get in shocks and stuff. I need to get Tally a super. But let's get some... At least he won't do much, but he still has a good chance of doing damage. He doesn't have his Rhypo's play of Mass Makashu. Which he does. It's actually come from if you have watched um, Attack of the Clones, he just, before he's, he's going to face Obi Wan Kenobi, he does that and spins his lightsaber. And that's where the ability of Mass Makashu comes from. But yeah, um, <coughs> I think. And my advice is teams that you should use is also pretty good. If any of you out there watching who are going to watch this play the Star Wars Galaxy series and really want to get Han Solo and really want to be and do really well against um, the Rankle, my advice get Darth Vader and make sure you get the Sator on him if you can. Captain Rex, um, clone. Magma Trooper, Grand Moff Tarkin. Um, I forgot who else you could use. Some people use Assault when characters. I would say use Darth Sion maybe because of his help by hatred. We use Darth Nihilus. You can get not a, a good like heal on Nihilus. I think the team still works. It's a very old tactic, but if I'm correct, it should still work against the Rancor. Because the Rancor's not had a rework. Um, Grievous might do well actually because he could nuke him so I think using Grievous would be a good thing as well Grievous used to be pretty bad but when he had his rework he can do, he's doing like 300,000 damage like, he is a Grievous nuke it's an ability he almost we call it um, if you watch his AoE because he does damage based on his max health instead of physical damage so max health mods are key so Barris Ophi is good if you want to have her leader ability, because she will increase max health. Yes, it'll be halved for this. It will only be halved for non Jedi allies, but it will still do enough. It'll increase damage. Let's take a look. We are ranting. Um, this video will be a bit short. It's just a galactic one. I'm going to try and do this. I've already completed it about five times. I think. Yeah, maybe. I forgot. Should I count shots? I don't really use him much. <coughs> yeah, you, oh, you need to complete it. 40. I thought it, was, it used to be 150. Yeah, um, I did. I have been level 85 before. Well, I think I did have Zetas. If I'm correct, I had a Zeta on um, Han Solo because his unique ability is one of my most favourites. I, I did have. Yeah, I did have. Um, I also had, um, I think it was um, something like a Zetra on a Darth Vader I had, but I didn't have Captain Rex, so I couldn't really do Rank or Raid. Yeah, so I say this video is going to be a bit short, I'm afraid, but I've got a tight schedule, got homework to do it and that, so I can't do well, I think I'll do this battle. Um, and I'll do one more for you because I haven't had much action. Wait, what? Why is Ezra here? What? Why have I got Ezra? Oh my god, have I? I'm an idiot. I've put Ev I've put Paris and Ezra. Oh, I didn't want to do that. We have to heal. Well, I'll get a heal. I did not want to do that. What am I doing? Why are they here? What? I hate it, but it, I didn't want them. I mean, they've done well for me, but I don't want them all. I need to save them. God, Gia knows you'd spy this team, but very weak. Um, yeah, my sister, you'd probably be Darth Vader, Darth Sion, Darth Treya, Darth Nihilus, and probably Darth Sidious. Or maybe I'll just have like a Sith Trooper. Sith Trooper's pretty good, like in terms of tankiness. Some characters, they have barely any abilities, or three abilities, and that. You think, oh, they're bad, but some of them could be really good. Look at IG 86. He, he does loads of damage. I was saying earlier to myself, I was saying how 
if in terms of like stats of top five for uh, damage, probably in fourth or fifth is IG86. If he's put with a drawing team, he could have massacre them. Always get critical hits. So powerful. Right, let's do this. Um, yes, yeah, so there'll be one more battle. I'm just checking how much time. Okay, this is the last battle, I'd say. Um, hope you guys enjoy this video. Just enjoy this last battle. I won't be talking until the end of it. So, yeah, hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, I'll quickly before I go, this I might actually be taking a break, so I, I appreciate your patience. So, uh, see you next time. So there you, go. there you have it, guys. That was victory. Um, sorry about that notification that you got. Eventually, this battle are at, will end. Um, maybe. Um, oh, Kuiper crystals. Yeah. Makes sense. So let's see what reward lies in this chest, and I'll be heading off. Yeah. So thanks, guys, so much for waiting. Um, I suppose I'll probably do a part two of this episode, um, and it will be the rest of these battles. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed.